practice exercises. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Choose the correct words to complete the sentences. 1. I don't know what to do, so I am going to ask my uncle for some advice. 2. There is always a lot of security before you can go on a plane. 3. I am going to join the Faculty of Engineering when I grow up, it's my intention. 4. Most people take clean water for granted, but not all places have it. 5. My cousin spends a lot of time posting photos on the internet. 6. Your computer password is very easy to guess, it's 1, 2, 3, 4. 7. I want to write a short story. It looks like fun. 8. You will find information about the sports club on the school notice board. 9. Raimi promised to help me to finish my school project. 10. Before you plant a tree, you'll need to dig a hole. 11. The teacher suggested going to the library to borrow some poetry books. 12. There will soon be the technology for us to all travel in cars without drivers. 13. The poem I read yesterday is really interesting. 14. They all have smartphones, so they are all connected to the internet. 15. We never allow bullying in this school. 16. The email said it was from a bank, but we all knew it was really a scam. Fill in the gaps with one word. Space tourism. Do you think people will be able to go to the moon for a holiday in the future? Some people say space tourism is going to generate a lot of money in the future. The training program will cost over $200,000, so it won't be available to most people. However, some companies have waiting lists of people who are hoping to become astronauts in the next two years. Perhaps your grandchildren will take their holidays on Mars. Four. Complete the sentences with the correct form of the verb in brackets. One. I don't think that people will ever live on the moon. Two. I should decided to buy a travel book. Three. Robert Louis Stevenson always wanted to be a writer. Four. I am playing slash am going to play volleyball with my cousins at the weekend. Do you want to play too? Five. The phone is ringing. I will answer it. 6. Look at those clouds. It is going to rain. 7. Do you enjoy reading poems? 8. We didn't understand the recording, so the teacher suggested listening to it again. Practice exercises. 1. Choose the correct words to complete the sentences. 1. Dahlia didn't have any friends when she started at her new school. 2. In Egypt, students in primary school have to wear a uniform. 3. The teacher gave us some homework for the next lesson. 4. What do you intend to study when you join the university? I am going to study engineering. 5. Why don't you volunteer at the new youth club next summer? 6. Did you break your arm yesterday? 7. We should donate money to charities to help the poor. 8. The beach was really crowded, so we couldn't find a place to sit. 2. Fill in the gaps with one word. Next week. Our school is holding a special event to help students to learn what to do after their exams. In the morning, 
We're going to watch videos about career choices and listen to speeches by people with different jobs. I think we will be able to ask questions, but I'm not certain. In the afternoon, we're going to work in groups and do some more research about the jobs we are interested in. 3. Translate the following into Arabic. 1. Ecotourism aims at providing holidays to places which are endangered and isolated. 2. Try to avoid mixing with bad friends who have bad habits. 4. Translate the following into English. Cyberbullying. The word cyberbullying refers to bullying on the internet or on a smartphone. Most teenagers have experienced some kind of cyberbullying, and it affects both girls and boys. One problem is getting offensive messages on social media, in texts or emails. Another problem is when bullies post personal information or pictures of someone. Sometimes it can be anonymous and that means the victims don't know who is attacking them, which can be very stressful. Teenagers need to know that they can talk to an adult about what is happening. It's important to report bullies on websites and the police can also help. Any kind of bullying can have serious consequences, so most schools have systems to deal with cyberbullying. It is very important to report any problems and help everyone to stay safe online. 1. Cyberbullying affects boys and girls. 2. Most teenagers have to talk to adults about cyberbullying. 3. Cyberbullying is not unusual. 4. Who needs to be safe online? Everyone. 5. What are the best ways of staying safe online? The best ways of staying safe online is to report any problem. 6. What can you do if you discover someone you know is a cyber bully? I must talk to an adult about him, her or report him, her on websites and the police can help. 7. Why do some people become bullies? Many bullies have been bullied before whether by family or just by their friends. Write an email to a friend telling him about a place you would like to visit on holiday. Include reasons. Why you want to go there, what you would do there and what time of year you would like to go. Dear my friend. When people ask me about the place I always wanted to go, I will simply say Paris. Why Paris? For now, let me keep this as my own special request to Allah, so that one day it will come true. Today the Eiffel Tower is the most important icon of France and one of the most recognizable landmarks around the world. Paris is usually known as the city of love. Some people also say that, Paris is the city of light probably because it has an amazing scenery during the night. I wish I could be there from June to August as the best time to visit Paris. Summer is perfect to relax on the beaches. Paris is the birthplace of fashion, so if you want to get a first-hand view of the latest trends, Paris Fashion Week is the place to be. You will see the best creations from the world's best designers. Plenty of celebrities take part in the event as well. Traveling around the world, I would never forget to bring my Nikon camera with me. As I really love photography, I would be the photographer and taking pictures along my journey. It is my dream to have my own picture. I would take photos while standing in front of the Eiffel Tower. I also heard that it is the perfect place for a marriage couple to go for honeymoon. Furthermore, there is a place in Paris known as Canal Saint Martin. It is actually a river in the middle of the city. It has an amazing scenery during the day and night. It would be so wonderful to enjoy.
I would enjoy going shopping and eating different kinds of French cheese. I would have my breakfast in the morning at Paul restaurant. I am looking forward to hearing from you. Don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe to my YouTube channel.